you know you're going to get a chance. And the way that he's going, he knows he's going to score. He's got his hottest stick as anybody in the league. Reinhardt starts the game with Barkov and Verhage for the Penguins. Crosby, Gensel, Pittsburgh pressing 11 forwards, 7 defensemen tonight. Here's Ludwig with the drive. Colby Armstrong just talking about him moments ago. What comes to O'Connor. The Chuck out for Nico Mikula fires wide. Gensel up the boards, not out. Held in by Montour. Play there to hold that line. There's Bennett with a shot, gloved by Jari. Now well, Reinhardt slides it across. Save made by Jari. Puck loose behind the net. Mike Sullivan said this morning, motion, bodies at the net, and pucks to the net. That's what this power play has got to do. Puck covered by Bobrovsky. As Barkov now carries it back out. And now Mikola with Reinhardt. Under nine minutes remaining in the first period. Kenny Albert, Eddie Olchek, Brian Boucher. Here in Pittsburgh, O'Connor. Back out for a shot by Ruino. Rodriguez dropping it back off. Backhand shot. Montour turned aside by Jari. And Malkin's talking to Graves on the bench right now, Edge, about that play. Right, okay. He's standing up. He's, you know, having a conversation with Graves down at the other that's end of the good. bench. Yeah. Uh, that's what you want. I mean, we're going to take a look at it. Yeah, he can show everybody. Yeah, he was I, saying bank it off the wall. Yeah, right. Behind okay, you, yeah. yeah, right. But, I, but again, I don't know. I mean, if you're Malkin, you got to be, you, you got to be ch talking to him, you know, helping him out. I mean, the defense been there on the play, and a guy like Graves, he's just worried about, good save there by Jari. He's just worried about making sure he doesn't turn the puck over. They killed off the first Penguins power play. Those shots for Pittsburgh during that two-minute stretch. Here's Crosby with a shot knocked down by Bobrovsky. Now you start the second period, a little four-on-four four action. Maybe that can kind of free up guys like Reinhardt to, to get going and maybe spend a little bit more time in the offensive zone. Only a playoff spot, but, uh, you know, being a chance at home ice. But they are where they are and going to try to figure it out. There's O'Connor with a lane, gloved by the, or Eller, gloved by Bobrovsky. I don't think he does go down on this No, he yet. doesn't, right? He stays right on his feet. Patience, boy. I mean, that is just, he made a save in the first period as well, where he stood on his feet the whole time. See, we just tracked that right into the glove. Two 40-goal seasons. He would have had 40 the other time if he didn't get injured. And his playoff numbers are off the charts. Puck in the crease. Backhand shot. Score! Raquel! Face-off win, he gets it, he fires it to the front, there it is. Now does that puck ever touch the stick of Lars Eller? Oh, oh, it oh did. look, he did. It did. It, it did. He touched it with the blade right before it hit the glove of Bobrovsky. After review, the Pittsburgh player did touch the puck with a high stick. Florida never had position in control of the puck. Back out for Eric Carlson. Lars Eller. Malkin tees one up. Saved by Bobrovsky. Puck is loose and it's planned. Clears it the length of the ice. They gain retrieval. And then the movement on the power play. That was another thing that Mike Sullivan said this morning. They have to have motion. Puck bouncing in front. The pass across. And Forslund winds up with it. Here's it ahead for Florida. Penalty is over. Rodriguez out of the box. Here's Rodriguez moving in across. They score! Rodriguez right out of the penalty box. Sets up Matthew Kachuk. The Panthers take a 1-0 lead. Never gets on the net. And watch these two passes here. Kachuk right in between the skates and the stick of the tank. And then Rodriguez goes right back to the same spot. Two passes there, Bush, in between the plate of the stick. One nothing lead here for the Panthers. Tough for Jari too, right? It can change sides one time. It can't change a second time. Once it changes again, you're dead. The ball coming just six seconds after the penalty expired. Here's Montreux with a shot. Score! Deflected in front. The Panthers now lead 2-0. Gadovich was crossing in front of Jari. He got a piece of it. They play in the, the dirty areas, and they win this puck out of the corner. And... Just simply get it to the net with traffic going there, and this is a terrific tip. In front by Gadjevich. 
No chance for Jari. But good work in the corner by the Panthers to win that puck. And boy, you know, you go back, a, a goal taken away for the Penguins on the power play. They think they have one. Ruido over for the Penguins. Battling with Sam Bennett. Puck comes back out. Ekblad has some room. Moving in. Shoots. Score! 3 nothing, Florida. It's the second unit that does the job. They win a wall, wall battle once again like they did on the earlier goal. And Look at this change of the angle here, Bush. Yeah. Just by Ekblad. Look at that. The drag and shot to the far side. That is a thing of beauty. And you got a little bit of a screen, too, here by Carter after he after he drags it, right? Cousins with it for Florida. Buck forced out by Carter. Two-time Stanley Cup champion with Los Angeles. Had it strict. Cousins, lead pass, Kachuk. Kachuk moving in. Score! Third point for Kachuk. Liddell deflects it past Jari. 4-0 Florida. Right here. And then all of a sudden, the Penguins go for a change. The quick up. Kachuk can't get it over right away. And Lundell stays with it. And another beautiful pass here from Matthew Kachuk. It is going to be a battle. This is game 50. And we mentioned earlier they have games on hand. And now they have a goal. The shot by Kinsel. Now a 4 1 game. are on the board. Crosby moves it up. The shot is blocked and then Rust right off the side. Does he get a piece of this? I can't really tell. It goes off something there, whether it's the defender or Rust, but for Bobrovsky, it'll be another. He was frustrated because he's trying to kick out. Florida has requested a coach's challenge for goaltender interference prior to the goal. Paul Maurice won a challenge earlier in the period, now challenging for goaltender interference. Well, Rust was right there. Is he allowing Sergei Bobrovsky the opportunity to play his position? Well, I don't think there's anything there. After the coach's challenge, the call on the ice stand. We have a goal. A minute remaining on the power play for the Penguins. They trail 4-1. Riley Smith, near side, Rust, reflected, and Axel raised the stick, he started to celebrate, no goal. Oh, what a redirect there. Hands were going up by Gensel. Got blocked in front, and now the outlet pass, breakaway opportunity for Kachuk, and he is stopped by Jari, gets the rebound, is taken down in a penalty. Here's the breakaway pass, and then Kachuk what behind him, stopped by Jari, and then he was cross-checked by Latang. Happy Valentine's Day to Diana Olcha. Wow, Edzo making us look bad, Kenny. Into the Penguins, four to one. Malkin moves the puck ahead. There's Carlson towards the net, redirect and a save. As Carlson jumps up, Nicola's going to come over. That soft pass there. Look at the redirect, and it goes right by the stick. What's impressed you, Eddie, about this Florida Panthers team tonight? Well, I mean, the guys talked about it in the studio. I mean, they can play any way you want. And, and there's a purpose. Look out. That, was good. that, that goal's going to count. The original shot by Lundell, and then Rodriguez in the vicinity. It is 5-1. Florida, second of the night for Lundell. The shot is blocked. It's up top. Nobody knows where it is. Jari has no idea. I don't think Rodriguez touches that puck. Nope, he, yeah, he never did. Wow. Never did. I mean, you talk about bad luck. Hey, you know what, though, Bush? Rodriguez was the only guy... This has been a constant theme, Eddie, in our last couple of Wednesday night broadcast goals from the third and fourth line. Shot, score! Ludwig, his first in the NHL!
for the Penguins, able to get out of their zone and watch the drive by Raquel. And that opens up the scene for Ludwig. What a pass by O'Connor. Nikola comes away with the puck, taken away by Gensel. Well size pass, Carlson settles it down. And a oh. save by Bobrovsky and a big one on Gensel. Gensel and Mikula keep going at it. I mean, this is... And what a save here by Bobrovsky. Off of Jake Gensel. We have some legends coming back for the bird for that night. Panthers will go to 34, 15, and 4 as they defeat the Penguins 5 to 2. You know the run for the Florida Panthers, but for me, the story with the Pittsburgh Penguins is yeah, they did lose a game here tonight.